Mike Myers and it's time for another Security 101. This week I want to talk about browser toolbars. And I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. You may be shopping somewhere and it installs a little toolbar right beneath uh, your forward and back in your browser. Uh, you may have a Yahoo toolbar or a Google toolbar. And just about everybody's a toolbar these days. And I've been places where the toolbars are this big and the stuff you see is this big. So there's more toolbar space than there is actual white space to see a website. And uh, there's a, some warnings with these. First of all, they are slowing your machine down. Every browser you add, every uh, browser bar you put on there slows your machine down. They're all wanting resources. And the bulk of them will even communicate back, constantly telling people what you're doing. So it's definitely a privacy issue. But there's also some that do things a little bit sneaky. Especially if you get some that from, are from a shopping site, they will look for your searches and they will interrogate what you're searching for and try to give you results back in place of what you were looking for in the search engine. So they may give you a result back inside of the Google results. They'll actually insert themselves into there with their ads and their links so they make the money. So you get very careful about these. I never recommend you use any browser toolbars unless you really, really need it or you know what it is. I don't even recommend necessarily use the Google toolbar because Google tracks a lot of information about you. And if you're a privacy person, the kind of people don't like to know what you do, then you definitely don't want that on there. Now, it is a very feature rich, uh, and I do not believe Google is trying to hurt you. So don't take that the wrong way. They just, um, to give you the best experience that they, they can, they need to know more about you and your habits of surfing and what you look for. So there's a lot of privacy things in there. But there's like a Yahoo tube bar, and you start adding these, all these in here together, all this information is going to different places about where you're going. Plus, it's, it's slowing your machine down, and there are many of those that are not very good browser toolbars. They, they will inject things into your results. They will look what you do. Um, and some of them are actually just really nasty as well. Um, that's not the bulk of them. The bulk of them are trying to be good citizens. However, they are really taking advantage of you. So lesson is try to keep as few toolbars as possible in your browser to keep yourself safe and your machine running faster. That's it for this week on Security 101. We'll see you next week. Thank you.